Welcome to my water collection system. What I did, I put uh, my rain spouts on the shed and I made sure that the downspouts came over into this tank. And uh, it already had one big hole there, but I cut another hole so that both rain spouts go down. I call it the main tank. And then I have a secondary tank of another 300 gallons. But when this tank fills up, and the overflow takes the t uh, water down into my secondary tank. I also have four storage barrels behind. Now what I do with that, after it's all, all full, I take a little pump, a little uh, uh, fish pond pump, and I pump the water back into the main tank. And with doing that, uh, it comes over here, and I have... Uh, uh, a two inch line and with two spigots on it. This top spigot waters the top part of my garden. I could put uh, uh, a hose, a soaker hose on that and just turn it on. It'll water the, the biggest part of the garden. And then down here uh, is the main spout and <coughs> What we can do is run water in any one of the sprinkling cans. And as you can see, it has pretty good pressure on it. So it comes out pretty good. And then we can also put a garden hose on this spigot here and run it down to the rest of the yard. Then you don't have to carry your water supply. But uh, we can put a small hose on here and get everything that the top hose won't get.